students my name is sumit mehta so in today's lecture we will discuss integrals of some particular functions let's say the function given to us as dx over x square minus a square okay so i'll uh, tell you about the process of how to integrate this function and for further will use it directly as a formula okay so can i split this function dx over x square minus a square in a minus b into a plus b okay so using the formula a square minus b square equal a minus b over a plus b so now can i again dx over 2a and this is x plus a minus x minus a it will become 2a and in the numerate uh, denominator it is same okay so now can i write 1 by 2a out of integral because it is a constant minus x plus a dividing this by each term okay so now our integral become very easy okay so and as of now we know that how to integrate one by x function and where a is a constant so this is mod of log x minus a minus 1 by 2a here it is also 2a 1 by 2a log of x plus a mod plus c so in the logarithm as we know a property log a minus b is log a by b okay so i will use the complete so this is the integral of this function student okay so from now onwards i will use uh, the integral of this type as the this as a formula okay now i am telling you some more integrals for which i will not prove the result and will use them as these as direct results in our further questions okay the second integral of the same type is dx over a square minus x square for which it is 1 by 2 log of a plus x over a minus x plus c okay i am writing down the result directly because i have proved one result and will use all these results as a formula from now onwards okay and this is dx over x square plus a square which is 1 by a tan inverse x by a plus c so this is fourth is dx over mod of x square minus a square so which is log of x plus x square minus a square plus c the fifth result is dx over now the reverse of it a square minus x square which is sin inverse x by a plus c and the sixth but which is mod of x square plus a square for which the same formula of similar formula log x plus x square plus a square okay students so these are some of the formulas which we are not proving and we'll use the these as direct formula in our further questions okay now let's uh, move to another type of uh, questions
So students, if we are given a question like this, dx over some quadratic, so we need to split the quadratic first as a perfect square. So if I take a common, what I will get is b by a x plus c by a. So now can I x plus b by 2a whole square, which term I will get here is I will subtract from here. This is 4a square. Okay, so now put x plus b by 2a as t. So we will get dx as dt and writing c by a minus b square by 4a square equal plus minus k square we find the integral reduced to 1 by a type dt t square plus minus k square ok and now depending upon the sign hence now it can be evaluated by using the previous formulas of like dx over x square plus a square because k square is a constant so uh, as we know the formula for this as directly 1 by a tan inverse x by a so I hope students now you can solve it okay and similarly if we are given the integral of the type dx over root of ax square plus bx plus c similarly we can do this and we will get the some standard formula ok and similarly for other types like c type is px plus q over a x square plus b x plus c so where p q a b c are constant now as we can split p x plus q is equals to a times d by d x a x square plus b x plus c or plus some constant I can write this as some integer uh, differentiation of some this so which is 2 a x plus b plus some other b so we need to find out the value of a and b these capitals a and b and we'll put the value of p x plus q in these term okay so it will now become easier for us okay so I hope students now you are pretty clear about each and every type of integral and in the next lecture we will discuss some questions based on these integrals okay so stay tuned for next lecture students happy learning thank you